guys. <sighs> Thank you, Chester. Hi, everybody, and welcome to the show. My name's Siffle, and this Jeez. is... Dude. What? I just got a message on my machine uh -huh. from that stealth guy. The guy who hates you. And he, he said that he found out where I live again. Oh, He's dude. gonna kick my ass, dude. Uh, for real? Yeah, for real. So if I gotta go during the show, I gotta go, okay? Okay, that's but fine. just handle it for me or something, because I don't know what to do, man. This guy's yeah. serious. If he shows up, take off. You're going to know when he shows up, believe me. Really? Okay, well, we got to go to our interview now, so we'll see you in a minute. Hi, everybody, and welcome to the part of the show where Is we have still? interviews. I'm out of here. What? Bye! Hey, you punk-ass freak, where's Ollie? Oh, you must be stealth, huh? Damn right I am. Where is he? He's hiding from you, so... Well, you better find him right hey. now. You're next, buddy. Dude, you can't smoke in here. Put it out. I smoke because I'm a badass mother. Can you hold on just one second? Every cigarette is a tiny smoke signal beckoning the angel of death. You're kind of a jerk. Smoking makes you look cool. It makes you die young, which are both very tough. Yeah, whatever. What's, what's your problem, I'm a bad man? bad customer. Okay, tell me why you're after Ollie. I mean, this is ridiculous. What? That little jerk. I'm going to yeah. kick his ass. Well, why? A little punk drove a golf cart through my bar mitzvah. And not only that, he was dressed up like a beaver. Well, some things you just gotta let pass, dude. How the hell am I supposed to let that pass? Embarrass me in front of my whole family? I'm a family man! And he's gonna die at the end of your show! If you don't get him out here now! Alright, give me one second, I'll go talk to him, okay? Hold oh, on. so he's here. No. You little lion punk ass, I'd kill you. Well, good luck, buddy. Hold on. Hey, Ollie. Ollie, come on in here, dude. Is he gone? Yeah, he's gone. It's all clear. Come back in. No, he's not. He's right there, yeah, dude. Punk. Dude, I want you guys to settle this right now. This is ridiculous. No way. You talk this out. Get it solved. Um. Uh. Okay, look, dude. You can drive. You can drive a golf cart through my bar mitzvah, okay? That's cool. You're having a bar mitzvah? Yeah, I'm having one next week. Dude, okay, I'll be there. You're not even Jewish. Ixnay on the Uish J. Okay. What was that? I think he just said something in pig Latin, like, I'm not Jewish or something. You little punk! You're dead! After the what? show, the cameras go off, you go off, mama! It was just a stupid beaver costume! I can't even... I'm out of here! The black wrath of hell will fall from the skies. Bat wings sweeping your grave with black smoke, death, and hell. Okay, can we just settle this later then? Sure. Great. What mysterious coincidence links Prodigy and Pink Floyd? The answer coming up. Dude, would you just leave? You're dead. Okay? You're dead. You're gonna beat me up, wait outside or something, but you can't be here. Why? We're going to do a song, and you're going to ruin it. It's just your whole presence is going to just pop the creative bubble. I'm going to pop your skull like a bubble. Oh, cool. That's great. Hey, Thanks listen, dude. A lot. Listen, man. This is a special song. You have no right being here. You're yeah. going to blow the whole I'll, thing. You're I'm going gonna, gonna to kick his ass, and then I'm going to kick your ass. You're not going to touch me. And then me. I'm going to kick it like rock death. You hear me, you stupid no. little... Jerks. Hey, dude, you're not going to do anything. We're going to do our song. We're going to oh, do yeah. it how we want. It's going to be happy. We're going to make our audience happy, and oh, you're not yeah. going to get in our way. Because oh, our yeah. audience wants to be happy, right? So we're going to do a nice song for everyone, and everyone's going to smile. I'm going to come you're, kick your ass myself. You're dead. Yeah. You're we're going to be dead. real happy on your ass. Yeah. We're going to get real happy on your ass, buddy. Hey, get a load of this. You want happy, buddy? You got it, Buster. Well, it's okay.
Not unlike Pink Floyd's The Dark Side of the Moon and The Wizard of Oz, The Prodigy's The Fat of the Land perfectly replaces a soundtrack of Free Willy 2. Wow. From Sleepwalking? Uh, I don't know, am I? Well, I don't know. What are all these tires doing in the kitchen? Oh. I think you've, you've been sleepwalking and taking all the tires off our neighbor's cars. Yeah. I, I, I dream that I'm in the army, and I... Take, take tires, tires off of cars? Is yeah. that what you did in the army? Well, no, but uh, we use tires to exercise with. <laughs> How do you exercise with a tire? Have you ever picked up a tire? No. They're heavy. Oh, okay. Um, well, I think we got to go to Precious Roy now. <laughs> Hello there, friends, and welcome to the Precious Roy Home Shopping Network. I'm Ollie. Hi, I'm Siffle. We are the spokesmen, as you know, for the Precious Roy line of quality products. Today, mom and dad, get the kids. They're not going to believe this one, okay? We all love pets, right? I love them. Yeah, yeah. But we also know they can be a bit of a problem. Right, oh, guys? You, you know about the problems I have with pets. Yeah, you got some serious-ass pet problems, man. With the Precious Roy Lice Monkeys, all your problems are over. They're quiet, no messes, never run away. These, okay guys, these, these aren't gonna chew up your newspaper. They're gonna start writing their own newspaper, okay? You're gonna grow whole civilizations in a glass of water. And you, you can watch them go to school in the morning with the free magnifying lens, not included. Watch them get married, folks. Let's take some calls. This is incredible. I'm overwhelmed. Yeah, we got to hear what's on the street about this. Um, hello. I'm a scientist, and um, I was wondering how big these things will get, because, quite frankly, I just, uh, I just don't see them. Okay, when was the last time you had your eyes examined? Okay, buddy? I, I think you guys are trying to push plankton on us good people. If you looked harder, you'd see the truth. Look with your heart. Get your eyes checked. Next call. Oh my god, 911, my son accidentally tr drank an entire glass full of lice monkeys. What should oh my I god, do? Now, did you call a vet? Did you call a vet? N no! Okay, what you're gonna need to do is make an incision from your son's chin all the way down his stomach, okay? But, but he'll and die! I can't do that! What's more important, huh? Your son or millions upon millions of civilizations? I, I see your point. I'll do it. I'll do <sighs> it. Thank you. Now, folks, these lice monkeys are your friends. They want into your homes. They need you to start their lives. They're waiting for you. Let's take a little talk with Precious Roy about it. Precious Roy. This is Precious Roy, and I just ate a handful of honeybees. Precious, what about the uh, lice monkeys we're trying to sell here? Buy my soda taffy. Pre oh, Precious. We're on the air trying to sell your lice monkeys. You're on the air, suckers! Precious Roy, Precious Roy, making lots of suckers out of girls and boys. Ready, Captain? I'm ready to take calls from the public. OK, okay cool. Uh, okay. Just pick up your phone and yell into him, and you should get through to us. Okay, okay caller, go, go ahead. Hey, you guys dig chicks? Yes, sir. Yeah, we yeah, dig well, chicks. I dig them an awful lot. I dig them, and they, they just don't dig on me. Uh, they, they just don't dig on you. No, they don't. They just don't. Why, Why did you sing that? Sing what, partner? You crazy son of a bitch. Listen to my story. Um, I want to know what's, what's your question? question? 
My question is, I want to know why I'll be out with a girl and she does not have any fun. And then I take her home, I take her home, and she just won't give it up to me. Well, me neither. You're exactly the kind of guy that makes it hard for me to find girls because they're a wreck after they go out with you. That's just you, dude. nightmare. Oh, God. All right, next caller. Uh, hi, my uh, ATM card only gives me um, a Monopoly money. Why? Well, I don't know. It's just giving me out all this fit. Well, what does it look like, your card? Well, let me see. Let me get it. Um, it it's yellow and it says community chest. And why do you think that's an ATM card? Well, it's shaped like an ATM card. Are you sure you're not just playing Monopoly? I don't know. What's the difference? Uh, the difference is not I don't important. Know. Put the... Uh, well, okay. You're exactly the type of guy that makes girls not like to go out with me because they're a wreck after they go out with you. Okay, That's next next caller. That's just you, dude. This is your landlord. Oh, God. Yeah, what do two, you want? Two words. Freaking monkeys. Do you hear me? Uh, hey, they're gone. Yeah, I want them out of there. You hear me? They're yeah. still there. No. no, we took them back, but they came back. You're liars, no. both of you. No, they came back because we let them stay up late. Either they go or you go, okay? Hey, you okay. just you you just try to come over and you see what yeah, uh, you'll, you'll see what sixty watch monkeys will do to you. Yeah, let's get out of here anyways. Yeah. This guy bums me out. I'll see you guys. We'll be back. All right. Chester's here today, and we're gonna talk to him. Chester's here. Hi, Chester. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> it's going pretty good. Yeah. Um, so, uh, let's talk about your past. Um, you were born in Las Vegas, right? Yeah. So what? Oh, no, we're just trying to learn about you, man. <laughs> All right. Um, and whenever you were a little boy, uh, you were put in, you were raised by a, a dance, a tap dancing troupe? Yeah, they, they kind of consider themselves a, tr a tribe. It's, they, so it's a tap dancing tribe that you were raised by? Yeah, they were, they, they had rhythm. <laughs> and is that where you learned to dance? Well, actually, I learned, uh, when I was about 15, I used to, uh, sit on the roulette tables and and I got a, an amazing sense of rhythm from that thing rippling across my ass. <laughs> I'll bet. What strange power links Mariah Carey to marine life? The answer after the break. Certain notes in Mariah Carey's high range have actually been known to make dolphins abduct and eat small children. Whoa. Yeah. Have you driven the new 3D Barbie van? No, I haven't driven one. All I've toys are all the toys are going holographic. In the future, everything is going to be holographic. So, what I mean, what do you buy? Just a holograph? All you producer? buy, all you buy is the base, the stand. It's got to be really heavy. It is huge, and then that <laughs> all your toys are produced through Holograms. the stands. Holograms. So Everything you, is going to be a hologram. So you can't touch anything then. No. You just in the future, look at it. no. In the future, you won't touch anything because everything will be a hologram. But you can get a lot more things. You yeah. just won't be able to touch them. Right. They're, they're holograms. <clears throat> okay, we got to take an interview now. Uh, here's an interview. Yo. Hey. Hip hop. How's it going? Uh, okay, it's the interview part of the show. And today's interview, through the ecstasy of technology, is via satellite to the moon, which yeah. we're really excited about. We're going to go to the moon and visit with our contest winners of the Syphil and Ali Free Access to the Moon contest. You might have seen that. Uh, these are the winners. They've won three years in space to do whatever they want. There's no mission total freedom. And you got to remember, these are three dudes from... Ohio University that are just kind of crazy to begin with. Yeah, they're not even trained astronauts. And I mean, up there, there's so much, you can joyride, you can do whatever you want up there. You know? Yeah, I mean, these guys are having fun up there. 
Yeah, and the there's no you, cops up there. Not on the moon. There's no cops, so rock, you know what I mean? So any second, we should be getting uh, yeah, the they transmission should be cutting coming into in. The, they should be cutting in any second now. But um, uh, this is going to be... This is going to be good. This is going to be exciting. Hello? Oh. Champs Fra 1. Fra this is are. Champs. Y yes, you're, you're on. These are the Champs 1 calling, or is this, is this the uh, Sifo Valley show? Yes, you're on, you're on the show. You made it. We got yeah, it. we just made it to the moon about 20 minutes ago. We are in that galaxy of Entobin. Yeah, okay, uh, everybody. We this went to a theme park there. We rode on the roller coasters. And then after that, we battled the planet with our, with our robot Zentar. We destroyed the whole planet within 22 minutes. Cal calamity? That, that's great. That's great. See, everybody, we sent a, a group um, who won the Syphilin Alley contest to the moon. So we were going to talk to them. April 1. Is this April 1? Yes. You're, you're on the show. Thank you're the you. Sh you're on the show. Um, has <laughs> are, you, are you enjoying it up there? We just made contact with a new creature. Are you okay up there? We're just going to be in a little trouble. Help. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, um, I don't know what's Can going on. I don't know what's going on up I'm there. I'm being transformed into a giant asparagus. <laughs> Dip me. Hey, come on in here. Come on. Come in here. This is calls from the public. Yeah, okay. I was going to drink a water. Oh, really? Listen to how much water I drank. Wow, that's really cool, dude. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, calls from the public. Here we go. First caller. Caller, go ahead. Uh, yeah, I'm having a little bit of a problem in the bathroom. Oh, yeah? What number? What number? Yeah, like one or two. Or... Uh, three? Three? What's three? Don't make me say it. It's so embarrassing. I I say what? I don't know What's what three? three is. Shaving. Oh, that's totally normal. <clears throat> yeah, don't worry, buddy. Really? Yeah, yeah that's, that's just part of a man's cycle. cycle. It happens once a month. Mm -hmm. don't, don't worry about it. Really? Totally, totally normal. So I'm not weird? No, no huh? it's, it's nature's oh, way. Thank you. Sure, no problem. See you later, pal. Okay, okay let's take another call. Caller, go ahead. Uh, yeah, what is, uh, 900 minus 400? 500. Okay, and what is 20 plus 20? 40. Okay, and just one more. Wait, what, what is this, ab is what is this about? What are you doing? Why are you asking us? I'm in, uh, I'm in math class right now. We're giving you answers to your test? I just thought I'd call and get some answers. That's, that you can't okay? do that. That's cheating. That's cheating. Oh, the teacher's coming, I gotta go. Oh, jeez, hey. okay. Hey, everybody, welcome to the end of the show. Well, dude, you just, you're just gonna have to... You're just gonna have to piece yourself together, man. I can't believe it. I mean, she, she just ripped me apart. Dude, that's rock and roll, man. Yeah, I mean... You know how it is on the road, dude. Yeah, I mean, you think these girls want something more from you, and all they want, all they want from you is that you're... They just want the limo. They want the rock. They want the rock. Yeah. Then they want to rock all night. They want the wine. It's, they want, it's tough. It, but you know what, dude? It comes with the package, man, because that's rock and roll, dude. You're right, dude. <laughs>